All right, so this is how to solve a Rubik's Cube in about five steps. So here's the first step. The very first step is starts with the top. We usually start with white because that's where the logo is, so a lot of people start from there. And your first goal is to make a plus sign, like when you're adding. Now the first thing that people don't understand is that even if you have these pieces up here, you can't just put them anywhere you want. They actually have to match the middle of each side. For example, this one's in the right spot, so it's white orange. Right here would have to be white green, white red, and white blue, and that's how you get it. So it has to be a plus sign, but they have to be in the right spot, okay? So since I already have one started, that's the first step. You find one, doesn't matter which one, you get it started, and you make sure it's lined up. If it's not lined up, you turn it until it matches the one side that you need, okay? Then we're going to search for the next piece, okay? This one's white red. Now, since I already have white orange, I'm gonna make sure that stays lined up, and white red needs to go right here because that's the red side. So I'm going to take this piece, hey, this looks like an easy one because all I have to do is turn it sideways, and all of a sudden it's in the right spot. And so is that one, white orange, white red. Okay, so now I need to find the next one. Hey, this one looks pretty easy. Okay, white green. And it's gonna go right here, and it matches right up. And that means there should be one more, which is right here, white blue. And it goes right up and I get a plus. Now it's not always quite that easy. So if you ever notice that a piece is out, and when you try and turn it into place, it's like upside down like that, even though it's in the right spot, it's mixed up. What you do is you just twist it down, and if you turn it one more time, it puts it right up where it needs to go. And then again, every time you're gonna make sure that it's lined up with the other colors and that you get all four the right colors with that middle color. Then you're done.